This video here is for new users of Turvo. And Turvo is the TMS platform that PortX Logistics uses. And it provides all of our customers with complete access, not only our customers, but also uh, our customers' customers as well. Uh, so with this, I'll show you the basics, uh, logging in, which is really simple. It's gonna be your email address and then whatever password you create. And then when you log in, you're gonna see the dashboard. And the dashboard uh, is going to look the same on any device. So uh, what's really nice about Turbo is that the platform looks and operates the same on any device. That goes for Mac or Microsoft, any tablet, any mobile device, uh, Android or iPhone. So as you're looking at it here, it's gonna look the same when you're looking at it on your phone. Now, you're not gonna to spend too much time on your dashboard or any of, or the majority of the features in Turbo, at least at first. Uh, most of our customers use it for the basics. That's collecting uh, PODs or invoices, uh, checking the status of a driver, uh, communicating and messaging with uh, PortX uh, team members. But, uh, you know, it does, the platform itself does have a lot to offer uh, in regards to those features. Uh, but again, the majority of what you're going to be using uh, is is the basics. And, and that's really uh, starting with the, the search box. And the search box is, is a smart search box. And what I mean by that is that it, it does most of the work for you. So as you start typing, it's going to search all data types. You don't need the full container number to find what you're looking for. You don't need your reference number or the port X reference number. Um, you know, sometimes uh, I don't even have it sitting at my desk and I just don't want to look in the system and find that shipment number to find this uh, shipment. And what I'll do is just, I will look by the delivery city. And uh, in this case, uh, we're going to Chihalas, uh, Washington. And uh, I search by Chihalas and the results uh, pop right up uh, with the shipment that I'm looking for. Because uh, that smart search box, it's going to populate the results, uh, you know, in by category and uh, by most recent. Uh, so uh, I search by Shahalas because I don't have that information in there. Maybe it's over the weekend. I'm at my my kid's softball game and I only have my mobile phone on me, and I got to find this delivery in Washington. I don't have any reference numbers, no paperwork. So I just look by that city name, uh, and and it pops right up for me, and I and I gain access to that shipment. Here you can see uh, the basics and, and really the, the, the information that you're looking for. It's gonna give you the status of the shipment, location of the drivers, uh, the scheduled delivery, the, the, with the driver's location, it's gonna give you the ETA. Um, it's, it's really a, a nice preview to have of that shipment and really uh, what uh, most people are looking for at first glance there. Now, you can get into uh, much more, you could see all the uh, the tabs there with details and timeline and messenger. Uh, we'll go right to sharing and the sharing tab takes you to the shipment link. And the shipment link is something that uh, at PortX we send out with every shipment. And we do this so our customer and whoever else is looking at the shipment doesn't have to log into their portal. They can simply click on that shipment at any time and see the current status of uh, that shipment. Uh, so our customers within their portal have that uh, the ability to to create a shipment link themselves. Uh, so if they, for some reason, didn't have one um, from from Port X, uh, they can create that shipment link and send it on to their customers. Uh, so their customers can easily just click on that link and, and check the status of the shipment whenever they'd like. Uh, what's also nice about the shipment link is that it does not prov provide any financials or access uh, to the invoice. So it's just that status. It shows Port X um, as the carrier. And uh, again, it's it's showing uh, on the map where the drivers are uh, in real time as well uh, with those drivers using the map, uh, the app, the driver app. We're gonna do another search here. And uh, this time I got uh, the last five of the shipment number and um, it's it's in processing. The status is in processing. That means it's it's been invoiced, it's been billed out. Uh, but I want to get that that invoice because uh, I need to check it out 
because it may be with my billing department, I go right into documents within the shipment and I'm clicking on invoice. Keep in mind, you're on your cell phone, you have the same access. Uh, you're, you're accessing the shipment on your cell phone and, and you can uh, get this, uh, th these documents the same as if you were on your PC. So here we have uh, photos. Uh, we, we include the transload photos on every transload we handle, and those are accessible to anybody. And uh, you can download those, those, those pictures, and you can email uh, the pictures as well uh, right from the platform. And again, from your cell phone, Android, Apple, any tablet, and uh, you know Microsoft or MacBook, you can email these documents uh, the same. Uh, on any device, download, email, you can even edit the documents as well if you would like. So uh, we checked out the transload photos. Uh, we're checking out the proof of delivery. Uh, everything looks good here. Uh, you can download and email that, that POD. A lot of our customers uh, access their portal uh, really uh, for uh, collecting those, those PODs, uh, but uh, also for passing those PODs along uh, to whoever they need to send them to. So we'll check out the uh, invoice here and uh, looking at the invoice, uh, something does not look right. I'm not seeing any charges. What's nice here is that you could stay within the platform and you can simply reach out to a member, uh, a PortX team member and communicate with them this way, reducing the email clutter. You know, we all uh, want uh, less emails in our inbox because we're all, we're all flooded with those emails uh, on a day-to-day -day basis. So I'm reaching out to the PortX team member and uh, just letting them know what I'm seeing on my end uh, with the invoice. There's no, uh, there's no charges uh, listed on the invoice. So I'm gonna check into that and I wanna see what's going on here. And this instant messenger it's like the same as, as Facebook or on your phone. You can attach files. You can use emojis. Um, here, um, I just sent this message uh, to myself, uh, my other profile, my other, my other user account, my real one. And with the notifications that I have set uh, in Turbo, and our customers can do this as well, when I receive a message, I get a text message on my phone saying that I have a message in Turbo. So I'm notified right away. And I'm able to respond from wherever I am, from my from my phone or my computer, and it's it's pretty uh, instantaneous. I, you know, the customer messages me, I get that on my phone notification, and I respond right away, letting them know that uh, I'm uh, going to assist and uh, get back to them as soon as I can. So here, uh, again, the customer checks out the invoice; they don't see the charges. They ask for assistance. I get that message uh, with a by a notification on my phone, and I uh, I respond to the customer just to let them know that I'm going to help them out. And right now I'm working on that invoice, and uh, I'm going to let the customer know when I am done and when that invoice is available for them when it's been corrected, of course, when the charges are listed on that invoice. So I never like to keep the customer waiting. Uh, I respond to them right away just to let them know that I'm helping out and uh, hopefully I get back to them uh, quickly uh, with that uh, corrected invoice or with at least letting them know that the invoice uh, has been corrected and it's available to them. So any second now that should be there. And there we go. So. Should be all set. Uh, I tell the customer invoice is ready and the customer goes back to the documents and there it is. The invoice has been updated. The charges are now all listed and uh, that was in a matter of uh, two minutes or so um, that uh, I noticed the charges were not listed. I reached out to uh, the PortX uh, team member to let them know and uh, they responded uh, within uh, uh, a few seconds and uh, corrected it for me, uh, again, all within two minutes. So that, uh, that instant messenger feature really, really uh, streams, streamlines uh, the communication and it cuts down, it reduces uh, the email clutter. 
We have another example here of this shipment I wanted to point out and show to everybody. Uh, this shipment uh, is a great, uh, great example of the driver app tracking. So I talk about real-time tracking and it's as true as can be. Uh, these drivers went from New Jersey to California in two and a half days and they were pinged in around 3,000 miles or pinged about uh, just over 9,000 times, you could see. So that's every every minute, every couple of minutes, every 30 seconds or so that these drivers are, are pinged and you could see their location. With that shipment link that I was able to create and pass along to my customer uh, for this particular shipment, uh, that customer uh, cus that customer's customer uh, was also uh, checking status of that shipment and wanted to know exactly where the drivers were and if they were on schedule uh, because the shipment was so hot. And by creating that shipment link and being able to share it and, you know, it, it allowed everybody access. It allowed everybody visibility on those drivers uh, in real time. So traditionally, I would have to call the customers, uh, call my customer at least, or call the drivers every hour, check status, and email uh, people every hour or so. I'd have to stay up late to keep track of these drivers because of how hot the shipment is. But with the shipment link, with the driver app, it takes all of that work away. And you just send out that shipment link and you forget about it. You're able to do uh, so much more uh, work that's on your desk uh, rather than spending so much time uh, calling people constantly, emailing people constantly. And again, it's it's advantageous for uh, our customer and our customer's customer and, you know, maybe the receiver or, or the shipper that just wants to see status or have eyes on those drivers uh, to, to check status. So, um, again, uh, Turbo is, is not only beneficial for Port X, uh, but our customer as well and our customer's customer. The platform is accessible from any device, uh, Mac, uh, Microsoft, any tablet, uh, any mobile device, Apple, uh, Android, and the platform is gonna look and operate the same. So uh, when you're using it on your PC, it's gonna, it's gonna look the same on your, your iPhone and you're gonna be able to access the platform, let's say on your, your browser on your phone, and also, uh, Turbo does have an app as well where you can access and navigate and, and, and check out uh, shipment status and, and, and download documents, uh, message Port X team members. Keep in mind, these are only the basics. Uh, the platform has much, much more to offer, many more features, and uh, I will certainly uh, tell you more about that in uh, more videos to come.